yo, I'm in Atlanta. And Bow Wow behind me. He don't know it's me. Oh, shit. I don't know. Yo. Yo. Yo, Bob, yeah. what's up? What's up, man? Yo. It's me. <laughs> what was Jess. you? you know Jess. I, I just hit a million today. A million what? Come a on, million man. followers. What? Nigga, you know me. What's up? Bob. You got time jet waiting, man. I yeah. said, little Bob. Did I smash? You might have. Did you smash? <laughs> hey, man, get the jet, man. Nigga, what jets? You don't have a jet. Stop. <laughs> so, basically, Chris went out last night. And I got some questions for that nigga. Crass! 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 Why is the door closed? Hello? No, for real though. Like, why was the door closed? Not today, Jeff. Not today. But the door was closed today, so it has to be today. So... I can't get no fucking privacy? Uh, no. Privacy is for single people. So what you're telling me is you want to be pro... Ah. Uh, oh, I... So what you're telling me is you want to be single. Because according to Snapchat, you were single last night. Because I was texting you and you weren't texting me back. So I'm thinking you drunk and you having fun and you feeling yourself. But then I get on Snapchat and you're constantly updating your story with snaps. So you were functional enough to operate Snapchat, but not functional enough to text your girlfriend back. But I bet she responded to your snap messages though. Jess, please. Okay. Good morning, it's Jess with the mess, and my muse is real. Delusionist artist Bow Wow. <laughs> Delusional. <laughs> What's wrong with him? <laughs> Sorry. Last night, Bow Wow Snapchatted a picture of a stack of money. Caption, I've always been rich. Don't come for me. Insiders screenshotted and zoomed in on the picture. They found small print that read, Property of Fugazi Printing Company. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> in other news, in other news, in other news, <clears throat> in other news, Odell Beckham posted a picture of himself getting ass shots. Oh, a tattoo. Oh, <laughs> tell me something. <laughs> the tattoo reads in bold, fancy letters Enter here. Ah. Oh no, baby. What is she doing, baby? That's not the one. As a matter of fact, that is the one. <laughs> Imagine him being arrested. Drop the oil and come out of the closet, sir. So what's up, y'all? Y'all already know what it is. Hey, Jess, this heavy. Like uh, what are you getting cute for? Jess, please. I got the beater and some shorts. Uh, the beater is fresh out the pack, and they're Jordan shorts. Where the fuck you going? <laughs> I'm going to the gym, Jess. This nigga wanna work. You don't even have our membership. Fuck, it's your first day? No, this is day two. Hmm. <laughs> So what bitch got you working out? Because you're skinny as fuck. I mean, your beaters look like bodycon dresses. Where are you going? Like, who is at the gym for you? Like, I don't understand. What, where man. is this? You want to work out all of a sudden? Man. Oh, I want to work out. I want to get muscles. Mm -hmm. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to go find me a beater <laughs> and some Nike shorts and I'm going to go with you. Come on, let's go. Let's go. Come on, let's do it. I'm on exercise patrol. Come on. Let's get it together, because you can have a whole bitch meeting you at the jet. You know how them bitches want to be training. Oh, you need a trainer? No, bitch. No, 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 no. Trying to get you to pay her in dick. We're not doing that. We're not doing it. How about when a bitch thinks she's more relevant than she really is? Going around telling people y'all beefing and shit. Like, bitch, I don't even know you no more. You expired a long time ago, right along with that phony-ass beef we supposedly had. Gonna have one of our mutual friends come to me talking about, she just told me that life is too short to be holding grudges and, like, she don't want either one of y'all to die not getting to the bottom of y'all situation. Oh, I... Look, man, tell that bitch there's a lot of things going on in the world right now that I'm trying to solve. Bitch, I'm still trying to find a cure for these niggas wearing robbers so they won't be wearing sundresses next week. Bitch, I'm over here trying to save the world. I'm still in deep search of a TSA agent that can save Kanye West. Important shit. I'm over here trying to figure out whose beef was more interesting. N.W.A. versus Ice Cube? Or Tupac and Biggie? Or well, who did Lil' Kim surgery? Why Mayweather ain't hooked on phonics? Was Lil' Uzi raised by wolves? Just what the fuck is that tatted in between DC Young Fly's eyebrows? Who the fuck is breaking in all these celebrities' houses? Why the fuck Omarion like his women like he like his chicken? So you want your bitches fried? Oh, you want a baked bitch? You want your bitches to roll around in flour? Then go jump in some hot grease. What's up, IG? Listen, I need y'all to tell me was I wrong. I'm right down the street. I see one of my homeboys just came home from prison. He flagged me down. Hey, just come back. So I get out there. I'm chopping it up with him. And he lets me know that he's now newly Muslim. As he's telling me about all the barbecue pork ribs we gonna have at the cookout. So now I'm feeling like I want to M-check this nigga. You know when you in a gang, you get G-check, right? But this nigga strolling around repping Muslim, right? So I want to M-check this nigga. So I say, what kind of Muslim are you? 
because you know you got the Sony and you got the other ones too. This nigga didn't know what department he was in. Oh shit, I'm a regular kind, sis. Oh, all right. Fuck is a regular Muslim. <laughs> you crazy, yo. Nah, I'm, I'm, I'm type one. Eh, hey, I didn't ask you about your diabetes, bruh. So basically, this nigga went to jail and was scared. So he converted to not get his ass beat. So I told him, man, I said, nigga, you ain't a Muslim, you a prism. That's the type of nigga that goes to prison and needs to fit in real fast. Nigga, you converted to Prislam. Boo, your middle name is not even Muhammad. Happy Memorial Day, it's just with the mess. Wiz Khalifa started some controversy behind his Memorial Day tweets. When you get my age, Memorial Day is about getting shit-faced by the pool, eating some barbecue, and not remembering shit. So yeah, millions disagreed. But that's how it's going down tonight. <laughs> Especially for me. <laughs> Boo, live your life on the edge. Sorry. Tyrese posts a picture of Taraji P. Henson with a new haircut, channeling her inner dyke. Lesbian. Sorry. The question is, is there a Baby Boy 2 coming or not? I mean, he's the only one posting about it. <laughs> Nobody else has said yes. <laughs> we don't want it. We don't want it. <laughs> Tamar Braxton posted a picture of herself after getting more work done on her face. She's starting to get that panther look. That, like Tiana Taylor at the end of Fade. People are complaining that she looks just like Nene Leakes. Then we like to get angry when they say, you all look alike. <laughs> well, we all have the same surgeon. <laughs> Good afternoon, it's Jess with the mess. Apparently, Rihanna has been gaining some weight. Maybe she laid off the weed. <laughs> Insiders think she could be pregnant. Pondy baby, pondy baby. <laughs> Boo, it's probably just Depo. Little Cat, I mean, Little Kim, so sorry, has had more work done to her face. At this point, she looks like a man that wants to be a woman. <laughs> so sorry. Reporters asked Little Kim, when will you be done with cosmetic surgery? She quoted, well, you know, in the words of my bro, can't stop, won't stop. <laughs> Ouch. Girl, if you don't get- Boo, you're not even human anymore. Nicki Minaj takes a picture with Birdman. What? Well, we know who's getting the BET's Most Disloyal Award this year. <laughs> pick a side, pick a side. <laughs> Breaking news. Black youngster may be on drugs. We have disturbing footage that may prove so. Good afternoon, it's Jess with a mess. Oldie but goodie groups are looking to rekindle the flame in their careers. Escape is getting back in the studio for one more album. Also, Drew Hill. Even what's left of Boys to Men. Shit, let's just dig up Marvin Gaye. <laughs> Sorry, sorry. In other news, judge erases Aaron Hernandez's murder conviction. Ah, 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 his dad? Let him rest in peace. State's attorney requested that they use a Ouija board to contact Hernandez to confirm conviction. That's fucked up. Anything to win the case. Shade Room posted a meme that started controversy for women. I quote, name a few reasons women cheat because we're better at it. <laughs> I've been cheating for years. <laughs> Sorry. No, I haven't. Some strange white woman threw away all of her makeup and shaved her head bald. Not to support cancer, but to start a natural beauty movement in hopes that women all over the world would join her. Boo, you're weird. No one else is gonna do that. Yo, let me tell you what's crazy, right? I go to a fucking corner store in the hood, right? To get these. Bitch talking about, I need to see your ID before I can give it to you. Bitch, I look old as shit. What the fuck is you talking about? Did I sound like a grown-ass man? You don't believe I'm over 18? I look like I got an 18-year-old, bitch. What is wrong with you? Niggas don't even believe it. I'm 25. Niggas be like, I thought she was 30. That shit made me so mad. Why is niggas still getting carded in 2017? Bitch, I look older than you behind the register. Then your store is in the hood. Niggas in the hood not walking around with their IDs. Everybody in the hood done lost their ID. What is you talking about? You want to see my ID? When the last time you seen an ID, miss? Like your store is inside of a row house connected to other hood ass row houses. So technically you're not even a real store. Like you being stingy. Like you don't even want to give it to me. So I just took my ass somewhere else. Ladies, you ever claim a nigga on all your social media? I mean, because y'all only been fucking with each other half your life. <laughs> so you feeling slightly obligated to this nigga, right? Now he won't return the favor. And that shit gets under our skin. Because the reason always is, I just don't want niggas all in my business, yo. Like, I would throw you up there for real. I would post you. But I don't like niggas in my business. All right. 
But yesterday you posted a picture of your check after you cashed it. <laughs> then after you cashed your check, you posted what mall you were going to to get fresh. <laughs> after you came from the mall, you posted a picture of the outfit that you just bought. Then you also kindly told everybody where you would be drinking. <laughs> and you put the location in the last post. <laughs> then every day, <laughs> you post pictures standing in front of the same wall on the same corner. <laughs> so now everybody knows where you're selling drugs. <laughs> so what you're telling me is either I'm going to help you get caught by the police or I'm going to help you get caught up by the bitches you fucking with in the DM. Post me. <laughs> Good morning. Caption this, yeah. Yeah. Hell no, I said fuck all that shit. It's hot as a bitch today. I done snatched the wig off and threw the bonnet on. It's so hot I had to put this shit in the freezer before I put it on my head. Yeah, that's the new wave. Y'all can just start calling me Young Popsicle. I'm about to be Team Amber Rose out this month. Matter of fact, that's too much hair. I'm about to be Team Charlemagne out this matter of fact. That's too much hair because he got hair on his face. I'm about to be Team Naked Dickhead out this motherfucker because the actual dick ain't got no hair on it. Yeah, I'm about to get rid of these eyebrows. Get rid of this little bitty mustache I got. Tired of nair and that shit. Top lip be raw as a bitch fucking with the nair. Can't use Blistex for 18 days after you nair your mustache. Yeah, I'm literally about to be bald head out this bitch. Then I'm riding around Baltimore with every other person outside happens to be a crackhead. Like, how hot does it have to be for you to say, man, I ain't fucking with this shit. Hey, uh, it's too hot to be high, yeah? It's too hot to eat something hot. Then bitches with no air in the car still try to smoke them cigarettes with the windows down. Hanging out the car trying to catch a breeze. Hot as shit. Hey, uh, ain't no breeze, yeah? Good afternoon, it's Jess with the mess. To cut back on cutting down trees to make paper, it is Donald Trump's plan to take all backwoods and roll up papers out of all stores. Well, that's a riot. <laughs> Ooh, now we gotta eat our weed. Happy birthday to 45 year old Buster Rhymes. I'm feeling like I'm running and feeling like I gotta get the weed, get the weed, get the weed, cause I won't ever stop and you know, and a note, cause you know I gotta weed every day, day. Every time a nigga said I gotta go, then I gotta go, then I gotta get it, and then I gotta be nigga to be doing, get it, didn't matter, and I gotta do it. Okay. Another home burglary. Michael B. Jordan's house was broken into just last night. <laughs> Who's next? <laughs> oh, no one cares anymore. So sorry. Congratulations to the Carters as they had a coming to America themed push party. I've heard of a push gift. What the fuck is a push party? <laughs> They're so extra. <laughs> Boo, just have a baby shower. You're regular people. <laughs> fuck. So oh, sorry. Sorry. Have a great day. So I took my son to school this morning. And you know they got a couple more days left until the year is over. Yay, summer. Oh, shit. I'm about to have this little nigga all summer. Boo, where's summer camp? So we walking in the classroom and this guy stops me. Introduction real fast. Hello, Miss Hilarious. I would like to go over a couple things with you before you take him to the classroom. Oh, I? Who the fuck is you, bruh? Hi, I'm Mr. Graham. I'm the school therapist. And I just want to tell you a little bit of things about Ashton. He is really bad. <laughs> a little disrespectful at times. And he can definitely be a handful at times, in case you didn't know. But nevertheless, he's really smart. Now, yesterday I diagnosed him. That's what I do. And it seems that he has severe ADHD. And I just wanted to briefly go over some medications that could be prescribed for him. But before we do that, I'm going to need his insurance card because I get paid for what I do. Oh, I... I didn't ask you to do that. And I'm not just a comedian. See, I be diagnosing niggas too. Oh, they ain't tell you? Well, judging from your shoes and everything you just said, looks like you have me fucked up. And now I'll prescribe some get the fuck on. Have a good day, sir. So, as usual, it's always a couple people that's mad about the video that I posted. This bitch gonna comment and say, um, I'm confused. Why would somebody even fuck with a nigga if she know he got a girl? Ah, uh, it's the way of the world. That shit happens every day, B. Boo, welcome to 2017. Everybody does it. Not that I'm justifying it, but for many reasons this happens. I mean, I got a friend, somebody I fuck with for real, for real. But like, she ain't my girl, but like, we fuck with each other for real. But what's up with you though? And then a bitch gives out the number. And then now listen, listen, take heed to this. Let me also explain something to you. Why do bitches fuck with niggas who got girls? I mean, this is real shit. For real, come here, come here, come here. Come here, you, come here. Bitches don't give a fuck, okay? Boo, ho is life. Good morning, it's Jess with a mess. Jamie Foxx, also known as Eric Marlon Bishop. <laughs> who the hell is that? I thought his name was Jamie Foxx. Who gives themselves a new full name? <laughs> so sorry. How about Kylie and Chloe's new photo shoot? I swear they look the same age. <laughs> While Kylie's face is very strong in the shoot, it still doesn't come close to Chloe's strongness. Did you see it? <laughs> They're both like, I chew face ass. <laughs>
You look like the photographer said, hold that sneeze, hold that sneeze. That's the one. <laughs> Boo, no it's not, it never is. Chloe's been doing that face for years though, that. Sorry. Adrian Balon apologizes to Nate Turi on the set of The Real about how things went down in their 3LW days. She's on power, doing much, much better than her. I would apologize too. <laughs> Boo, I'm on power. Stay on this talk show. No, we can't make 2LW. <laughs> Prometha, Prometha, thank you for the apology after 30 years. <laughs> Shout out to Tamika Scott for apologizing to Candy. <laughs> Good morning, it's Jess with the mess. Sorry for the absence. It's not my fault that these celebrities have no wives. <laughs> Sorry. Whoever Timothy Sykes is revamped the Bow Wow Challenge by telling Bow Wow to match $100,000 to donate to his favorite charity. And that was three days ago. And there still has been no response from Bow Wow. I just got one word. Sheether. <laughs> Boo, he doesn't even have 100K. Amber Rose posted a picture of her in French Montana in the club. In the picture, it looks like he's elbowing her titty. But it's just a friendly gesture, as Amber explains that's only her friend. Kiki Palmer commented under the picture, I love that everyone hates you. Really, they don't understand you. Stay awesome, Red Heart. Ah! Boo! Everyone doesn't hate her. Everyone hates you. 27-year-old black youngster goes to jail behind young Dolph shooting. Ah! He's 27. Boo! Black does crack. 